Hello, this is another update for the EVA platform. Uh, version 1.4.0 is uh, almost there. I'm going to uh, mark the release after I record this thing. Um, so the big thing about this um, release is that we have Mosquito support at this point and it's brought to you uh, by you people uh, who uh, donated um, a lot of, um, well, gave me a lot of support um, with with this. It's not only about uh, PayPal, but uh, also uh, a lot of great ideas were uh, from you people that were implemented over here. Um, I got, uh, I get continuous support really from Ratrik. I also got support from Bontech, which was very nice. Um, so, uh, thank you to all of you people involved in the in the platform. Uh, I said it many times uh, already, but yeah, it was uh, it was great how this uh, release uh, came to life. Um, and pretty much outside of Mosquito, there's um, not too many changes. You'll see that I reorganized everything because it's um, I am just unable to um, manage all of the files and uh, you know variations of, of uh, all the carriages. Before I cleaned up the document in Onshape, I had like uh, when I exported everything, I had like 86 permutations of all of the carriages. I cleaned it up and boiled it boiled it down to um 36 i believe and you can find them in the assemblies page when i'll show you which i will show you in a moment uh, not much changed over here only for those who do not know uh, there is i'm moving a few pieces for the sake of that cleanup i'm moving a few pieces outside of the eva project and there will go there's going to be an eva add-ons project um, that will um, have stuff like tool, tool boards and and such. Um, for the step files, nothing changed. It's all here. All the printed parts that are not listed elsewhere, you can find links over here. If you don't wanna, uh, if you don't want to, um, you know, navigate through the repository on on GitHub. Also, there's always an option to like download this whole thing as a zip file. It is a few megs already because it's going to pull all the images and stuff like that. But um, for some of you, that may be the easiest. And yeah, for assemblies, I did such a thing. So we can go over here. I guess the veterans will not care about uh, much about this thing. But when someone's um, uh, for the first time of being introduced to, to Eva, it's going to be easier to find the thing he's looking for. So you can pick, I don't know, Core XY, Mosquito, and Titan, and then MGN15, which is, for example, Vicor Pro, and you can go directly to to this assembly page. It will uh, drag you. It will direct you to the sub assemblies page, so we can take a look at how. Core XY is uh, the Core XY back is looking uh, or how it looks um, and the uh, bomb for the whole thing. So we need to get those pieces um, to be able to uh, build yourself this carriage. Um, if you want to have all of the screws, and I hope I generated this and calculated everything. Uh, properly, you should be able to uh, with this superset bomb superset. Um, if you get those parts, um, if you get all those parts, you should be able to build one piece of any variant of of Eva. And since it's all now directly pulled from on shape, that was a lot of work. Uh, you'll see different things over here like. Uh, V6, V6 uh, heat break, um, which is just 
um, uh, E3D's model I'm uh, I'm using over there to you know to put uh, the V6 on on my in my CAD. So uh, you can ignore that or treat it as a reminder that yeah you need to have it. Sock is the 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 blue thingy that day and that you can get for the plastic not to uh, be glued so yeah it should be not to be glued to the uh, heat block um, so yeah um, I don't suppose people will have any issues with those names the rest of the rest is rather self-explanatory um, yeah PTA feed tubes that was missing previously and on some of the assemblies like the BMG ones um, I couldn't get around to do to mark it properly in the CAD document so there's a note to remember about it uh, with the exact uh, length of the PTFE tube that you want to put between the um, between the heat break in the V6 example and the BMG and it depends if you're using BMG or BMG M it's going to be different Oh yeah, and Mosquito has it even uh, has an even shorter PTFE tube. List of uh, almost all sub assemblies. Uh, people looking for the IDEX or IDEX backs. It's the same bomb as for the Cartesian one. Looks a little different, but <clears throat> yeah, there was um, there was no clever way. I maybe figure I'll maybe be able to figure it out later on. I was thinking if I should put e uh, IDEX on Eva add-ons, but that would probably cause uh, too much confusion. Um, and yeah, this is probably all that I have for you. Oh yeah, I got rid of those carousels in the assemblies. Uh, I hope that no one will bother, but it's just too many hours to release one thing for this simple yet kind of redundant feature. So I got rid of it. I also got rid of, of the uh, exploded views. Uh, those were not providing much. And if you want to see exactly what's um, what's going on, how to assemble something on ship now has oh crap and it's linked to the uh, inappropriate version need to fix that before i release uh, if you want to see what's what you can go into assemblies sub assemblies for example um no you can't because it's the wrong document This will be the proper link. It's going to be 140. And if we go to assemblies, sub assemblies, faces, face mosquito, for example, toggle exploded views, explode. They added lines uh, recently, so you can go step by step over here. No, you can't. You need to be logged in. But oh well, it should be. You can rotate it and see where, which part goes where. Don't imagine anyone will have uh, issues with, with assembling that, or any of those really. There are mistakes to be made. Like people forget about those nuts over here. But maybe I'll have time to make a manual someday uh, with all that. Okay, so fix this link and I'm trying to scan. I'm always trying to prepare myself to record uh, this video, but it then ends. I'm no YouTuber, so you have to bear with me. And yeah, if there's anything wrong with the documentation or the bombs or the parts or whatever, um, let me know on Discord, that would be the fastest, fastest probably, uh, if not make an issue on GitHub. And that's it. Thank you very much. And 
see you next time. Bye.